a huge factor would be, of course, the ongoing pandemic. Mm-hmm. Uh, as much as we all want to be happy, we have to be sensitive somehow to what's happening around us. Uh, uh, napakahirap for you know everybody. Napakahirap ng situation, napakahirap ng panahon. So um, that played an important factor in, you know, keeping it to ourselves first. And then, of course, uh, bilang uh, public figures kami pareho, mm-hmm. we're both celebrities. Um, minsan na lang din namin kahit pa paano makuha yung uh, privacy, eh. um, lalo na sa relationship namin. So uh, we also wanted to enjoy it first. Um, and then, you know, to just share it to our family and closest friends first before uh, announcing it to the public. So, uh, important yun and uh, mas nasulit namin, uh, na-cherish namin yung, yung time na yun. And then, um, it was very difficult keeping it a secret for mm-hmm. a few months. So, since five months was matagal. Sabi nga ni uh, Tita Connie, because Tita Connie is one of the persons na nasabihan namin. Sabi niya, in, sabi niya imagine I kept tight lip for five months. Mahirap yeah. Madaldal ako. So, stuff like that. So, uh, mahirap talaga to keep it a secret at first. Uh, and to add to that, Alan, actually goes back to what we said earlier about me proposing, uh, na waiting for the right time, na the lesson we learned. Tama yung sinabi ni Carla, eh, we wanted to be sensitive because of the pandemic, so we didn't want to announce it. And we wanted to wait for the right time, na okay na lahat. So, we would have expected na by now, the the the, the cases would have flattened na, parang we're get, going back to normal. So, akala namin, Okay, now then all of a sudden now there's a resurgence happening. Cases are at an all-time high. Kaya it goes back to that lesson uh, when you wait for the right time, it may never come. Yeah, we felt it might be the right time then, then to to share it with, with everyone else. Kasi kung hindi, maybe they'll find out na lang once it's it's all happened na. And, and we didn't want them then to, to feel like we, ano, kasi syempre we wanted to savor it muna, keep it private. Pero we wanted them naman to know eventually and we don't want it to happen na they'd be the last to know na parang wala na lang. So, we felt that we owed them that respect in a way na din. So, especially the people who, who've been there for us, who supported us and have seen us grow as a couple. Okay, na parang why are there so much flowers here in this room? Nag-transform talaga yung, yung bahay because of all the flowers, the candles, the lighting. Ako may mga unfamiliar faces, people na may mga photographers, videographers. Um, in fairness, may mga familiar faces. Nagulat ako, una kong napansin was the florist stylist Gideon Hermosa. <laughs> Tating ang mask pa siya nun, ha? <laughs> Paso na pagpasok ko, siya talaga yung una kong nakilala, si Gideon Hermosa. Sabi ko, oh my gosh, Gideon Hermosa. But, um, uh, it was overwhelming, medyo mixed of emotions. Um, and then you, when I realized that it was for me that Tom was proposing, I was really just staring at the flowers and the candles. And then para akong nag-space out. Kasi I don't know why, pero ganun pala na parang hindi mo nari, wala kang masyadong marinig. So I couldn't even understand what Tom was saying, my speech. <laughs> Oh, halos hindi ko marinig masyado. And then, yun na, syempre, pag medyo nag-sink in na siya, uh, of course, I cried. I became really emotional, lalo na when I saw um, uh, Tom's family was there virtually. Nakita ko sila. They were yung mga faces nila parang ganito, ganyan sa screen, lahat ng ganon. Madaling araw sa US, pero uh, nakabantay sila dun sa purpose. Yeah. Take us around 3 a.m. 3 a.m. sa kanila yun. So, 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 Congratulations. May happily ever after din pala si Stefano at Adele. Wow. <laughs> well, um, I'm curious kasi si Tom, sabi mo kanina, you wanted the ring to be so sp- even more meaningful and more special. Mm. Kaya you decided to design it. Um, Can you tell us the story and the elements? Dun, sorry, talagang gawa ganun ako sa elements. Yeah. Uh, ring, sa details ng ring. Well, actually, ano pa lang eh. Uh, years ago when I wanted to propose, I spoke to Christian Bautista. 
So I got the jeweler from from him. He was the one who referred Radiant Lux to me. So but pero I'm a typical guy, walang kaalam-alam sa mga ring and knowing Carla, syempre who would know her best than her sister. So I I asked Erica, buti na lang she was ecstatic and excited enough to to help me uh go meet the jeweler and 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 sort out through the different ano the different stones that they had. Pero Alam kasi ni, Car- ni, ni Erica yung, yung ano eh, Car- Car- Carla has owns plenty of jewelry. So I wanted to make it special for her. Something that either she's never had or something that would be meaningful talaga. So yung mga tinitingnan namin dun, nothing, nothing was speaking to me and to us. As bigla, sabi niya, sige, I'll make a call. Kami, wala pa bang iba? Kami, I'll, I'll make a call. So tumawag siya sa Israel. As bigla, when I heard the number, Lumaki yung mata ko because 18 is a very significant number to the both of us. That, that was our, our, our anniversary when we became boyfriend and girlfriend is on the 18th. 18 din yung nakaset na date for the proposal. So when I heard that the stone was 0.18, I said, that's the right one. So talagang um, details kung details. So um, yeah. I, I hope this is not too premature to ask, but... um. You've been together for yeah a really long time. Um, do you have or mayroon na ba kayong like expectations of marriage of how it would look like? Your fears, your excitements Mm-mm. with the new with this new chapter. Yeah, matami yan for sure. Pero um, marriage is something that you should prepare for. Yeah. Pero don't naman din set expectations kasi that can, you know, make or break the relationship. Mm-hmm. Uh, as long as andyan yung family mo to guide you and other married couples that we both know personally who can guide us through it, okay na yun. Uh, yun yung importante. Yeah. So, you know, it's going to be difficult. Siyempre, hindi naman yan parang wedding na ang ganda, laging masaya and all. Mm-hmm. You know, will be tough times talaga, tough chapters along the way. But ang importante, um, you commit yourself to this person, kaya you'll never be alone. Uh, tulungan talaga pagdating sa lahat, even when it comes to decision making, kailangan um, pareho kayong uh, mag-agree, pareho kayong mag-decide, hindi yung isang tao lang yung uh, mag Yeah, your unit. Yep. A lot of, you know, there's going to be a lot of sacrifices, a lot of changes, but that's all part of um you know this new chapter in yeah, our life. Yeah, I agree. And it has to be like healthy discourse then talaga eh kasi yun nga uh, there will be things that you guys will be in alignment and things that you guys aren't in agreement with but you guys have to be able to bridge it. para para makapag-meet kayo in the middle kailangan ihain niyo yung ngayon at malaman niyo yung from from each other.